Hey guys, welcome to Pixel Piracy with me, Banto. So, this is gonna be the last episode before the full release of the game, which is uh, said to be released at the 31st of July. So, we're gonna see if uh, that's gonna be a release or not. But this is gonna be the last video before the full scale release of this in the game. So, let's get going. I'm gonna kill this damn chicken here. Always good to kill them to get some of these feathers and whatever they choose to drop. These turtles are really good to kill as well. Oh, uh, I'm not really hitting him very much. Come on, get him, pirate. I don't want to get slaughtered by these uh, turtles. That wouldn't be a good pirate story, would it? Get him. They hit actually really fast. I've, I thought that uh, turtles would be pretty slow. Wow. Okay, I got... Okay, this is not okay. I don't want to quest right now. Stop speaking with me. Okay, at least the game seems to have paused up, so... Let's kill his chicken. The turtles want to get us. Let's try to get him. Come on. Hit him! Oh, we dodge. Oh, they're both of them. I need to get my crew back here so we can actually slay these damn turtles. Come on. They was actually pretty powerful. And one thing that we need to get for our crew now is to get swimming for... Uh, Vince here. He do not have swimming yet, so we have to get it so he won't be drowning in the ocean here when we're fighting because sometimes Either you kind of like get knocked down in the water or it debugs out So it's always safe to try to have a swimming. Okay, Hork is pissed off here. So yeah, I have some gold So we can pay him his salary 25. That wasn't real. Oh my god. I, okay. I paid wrong That was 25 for Hork as well. Let's get these. It's really good to kill these because they have some valuable items. They can have items that uh, are good for upgrading your characters. They can give like different XP things and they can give uh, all kinds of things really. Yeah, kill a chicken. But I think we should go here and check out. I think they should have uh, the swimming skill inside here. Moose wanted to find your target and kill it. Go, go, find him. I don't really remember the name of that guy, but who knows, we might stumble upon him. He should have a special icon above his head if I don't remember it wrong, so... What are you doing, Hork? Picking eggs and feathers? You should be going to the ship. So, let's see what we can buy here. They should have... Oh, they have actually a lot of different skills here. So, there we got another swimming one. Recover life for the crew while sailing. Let's get that one. Can always be good to have. And I'm gonna check if we do have light steps on us. No, we don't. So I'm actually gonna get three of these. So my crew will walk a little bit faster. It is always good to be able to move around a little bit faster. It will improve our rating speed. It will improve our gold gain since we will be able to go between different places faster. Just as the sailing will improve our speed while sailing, it improves our gold gain as well. As long as we can beat the pirates and kill the things on the islands. So let's get going, where should we go? I think that we should actually head to a place where they have a pub or something. I'm actually gonna go for Saudi here and uh, they might have a pub so we can get up our morale a little bit here. And we have a fisherman, we have a fisher pole so I think that the food, if it's not already good, it should be good pretty soon. How much food? Oh my god. Okay, we have 16 fishes here. We need to get a barrel which we can store the food inside, but since we do not have that yet, we're just gonna put the fish with the poop. So later on we will have like um, one, two barrels and a barrel, I think it's 20 food that it can store, so about 10 fishes since they give one food each okay awesome we actually had a pub here let's get over here i really like to get to these pubs because yeah, you will regain morale but later on when you get more gold you can keep your rum supply up and you might not need to go back and search for these uh, pubs here there are actually tons of people here inside this one let's slay another chicken Everybody has a party, but I'm going and slaying chicken and crab. Kill him. Ship ahoy! Jolly Roger. 
But I think it's gonna be real fun that they're, they're releasing this game really soon. I mean, I have a ton of fun with this game, even in the early access, and I think this game has been progressing really good, and I hope to see them improving this game, adding features over time to this game. So it's gonna be interesting. And I do really enjoy these songs that they have at the pub. I think this is awesome. Kill a chicken. So, what do we got here? What people do we have? Stat value 10. If you remember the old version of this game, when it was going to recruit, they had like a hundred in the stats instead. That's because the stat system changed so much to the previous one. So, I think everybody's happy, so we're gonna go back to our little ship and go on a plunder, but we might have some stuff to sell here, so let's do that first. Yep, we had a turtle eggs. 89 gold, that's not too bad. Crab meat, we have three of them. They're worth some, but at the same time, I think that uh, keeping it can actually save us sometimes, because you never know when you're gonna need a little bit of health gain when you're traveling around, so I think it's gonna be good to save it. And by the way, I think we have enough, yep, yeah, we have enough TP points to learn swimming for Vince here, so let's get swimming and I'm gonna get Dr. Aura. Recovers life for the crew while sailing, so that's good to have. I don't know really how much it does do. He is everyone 25% skill per level, so I mean if this goes up to level 10, it's like 250% more healing, so that's really nice. And we can get light step for him, so 10% more movement speed, and let's get a hork, and he has no points, but I do have a little bit of points here, so let's get uh, light steps, and uh, five more. Yeah, let's go and get strength to 10, and vitality up to five. Did we? Did we? Yeah, we had some points here. So strength two on him. He still have a knife here, but I think I want to change this to something different. Five percent chance to parry. Hmm. Yeah, let's go for a cutlass. I mean, it does has a little bit more range. Actually, I think it's kind of much more in range compared to the dagger. The problem is if some enemy have a really long range with their melee weapon. It can be real hard to get in close and to fight them, so I think it could be good to go for this way. And we should go to some town later as well to try to find these barrels here so we can store some food. I do not know if uh, when this game is gonna get released tomorrow, that is, if it will be released that day. If we will need to recreate our characters or not, but if we need to, we will do so and we will create a new adventure and go and plunder the vast seas with them. Let's engage! Okay, let's go, man. So, three enemies. I don't think this should be a problem. I am a little bit low in health, though, but I don't think it should be a problem. Hopefully not, at least. If they haven't changed the game a ton since I played last time, who knows? But I wonder his fishing pole here. How much do that really damage? Hmm. Yeah, let's go for that. We will see how it goes. I'm tr gonna try to... I'm gonna get and use this crab meat here, so getting up some high health a little bit. I think that the crew still is a bit weird when they're fighting. They kind of like, if they're three enemies, they take uh, one each. And there's a risk that you will actually die with your crew because they are doing that really weird way, so. 10 health, and what do we else have here? 10 health, so let's get up that a little bit more. They're actually pushing down my health really much this time. I think the fight didn't go exactly as I wanted it to go from the beginning. Kill him, he's really low. Awesome. So now we have more than they do, so... Get back to the ship. Come on! Come on, ladder. These ladders are really stupid. Okay, that was actually interesting that... Uh, everyone else stayed at, stayed at the ship here. Where the low one only went back. You can actually add so they go back. I think you can see it here somewhere. Retreat. Can this pirate escape to a ship during combat when weak? No, it's done. So I'm gonna... I'm not sure. Let's try it out since I haven't really tried it before. So I mean it can be worth to know. And let's put it on everyone. Just to see how it will work. Do we have a chest here? 
Here we have something. Awesome. Not really much gold in that one. But keep in mind, like, it's okay, we have to... I have to get back and destroy this urn. If they haven't changed it, we're gonna see. Okay, they have changed it. Before, we actually had to destroy all the urns on the ship, so... We wouldn't be able to plunder it until we have destroyed them. So let's go and see where we should go now. Have one town here, and then three, then two. Let's go to Confluence and check out that town, what it has to offer for us. I'm probably gonna redesign my ship a little bit as well. I don't really like this... Uh, ladders here and they kind of screw up sometimes they it can look like they're actually climbing a li little bit faster than they used to with this but know that i have had a problem with it before like they get stuck they climb really slow when they're gonna escape like I saw before they get kind of get stuck and really all kinds of things so let's get over and see what they have to offer inside this shop here Come on, Hork, let's go. Okay, yes, I want to go and fish. I guess this guy might have a quest. Oh, he actually sells things. Where are we in? Okay, we was inside the cell. That's interesting. This is a special cellar because here we have something different, so... Barrels only cost 10 gold, so that's really awesome. Get two of those. What more should we get? 199 gold left. Is it something specific that we want to have here? Not really. So let's go over here. We do not really need to buy any food anymore. If they haven't changed the game much, because we do have our fishes here. And you see, we can even sell those. We have 16 fishes, 64 gold, so... You can actually earn a fortune with just fishing, so if you would take your whole crew and add fishing to all of them, add fishing rods to all of them, you would probably earn a tons of gold. But we are gonna get some of these rum to the ship, which will allow us to sail a lot longer and keep our crews happy, keep the morale up, so let's place this out. We got two barrels, so one's gonna be for food and the other one's gonna be for the rum. So see here, it goes down 10 fishes here, and uh, yeah, we only have 6 rum, so 12 servings of rum and 20 servings of uh, fish here, which you have to prepare still, so. Okay, world map, well, let's travel somewhere. Yeah, let's go for these pirates here. Oh, no, 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 not yet. Oh, that was good. That they didn't travel away from the captain, that would be pretty bad if they did. Yar, sailing on the vashies. It seems to go a little bit faster sailing now. I think it's because my crew got up the sailing a little bit, it increases the speed. I'm also gonna check if uh, we have any more points yet with uh, one of my members here. That did not have a light step. I think it was Hork, wasn't it? Yeah, it has no points yet, so let's go and plunder this ship. Have a little bit more health now than we had before. I actually am in combat with almost no health with my with myself. Sometimes it actually feels better to let a crew just go on the ship and uh, do the fighting themselves. Because sometimes you just kind of screw it up and the enemies will be hitting you all the time. Get him, Brandon. That was a pretty easy fight. It's a lot easier than the previous one. Awesome. Destroy the turn. And another chest. What do we get inside this one? A little bit of gold, some elixir, grindstones. And those I'm gonna use also, because that will uh, allow us to upgrade our melee weapons, so... There are some for ranged ones as well, the grindstone R and grindstone M is for melee, so... Let's plunder that ship, and... Uh, I'm gonna check out what we have here. Elixir, grindstones, I'm gonna go and... Uh, I'm gonna upgrade my weapon, I think. What do we have here? 5% chance to parry attack. Yep, let's go and upgrade my weapon. Level 9, that's good. 12 in damage. And we have some points to spend, so... 
let's get some agility. So we have some more dodge, 16% in dodge, and Vince is gonna get some strength, so we will actually be hitting a little bit harder than he used to do. But guys, this is gonna be it for today with Pixel Piracy. I hope you guys enjoy watching Pixel Piracy, and in the next one, it's probably gonna be the full release of the game. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be that. So, guys, thank for watching. If you like this video, please leave a thumbs up, and if you want to see more with me, subscribe, and thank for watching. Now, take care.